Hi, I'm Scott Campbell. Welcome to my window painting tutorials. Lesson 42, Clean Sweep. While I'm back at Beaverton Hyundai, one of my favorite accounts, and uh, I've got all my tarps laid out, as you can see, because I'm painting a pretty expansive uh, section of their store. This is stuff on top I did before, and now I'm just changing the bottom. I've got a little character I did, a clean sweep character, because we decided to do a clean sweep clearance 2015. And so on the right here where the arrow is, I have my little character, and over here on the left I have it actually taped to the window. And I'm laying it out kind of different this time. It's almost like a stick figure, because I wanted to get the pose down, so I, I, uh, I use that to uh, give me an idea of where to put all the forms, the arms, the legs, and everything. And uh, I've been doing a lot of sketching lately in different characters. Ones that I don't normally do, I, I kind of sketch out. So that's what I'm doing here. And he came out pretty good. Got the layout done. Over here I'm doing the letter sweep. And uh, some money is going to be flying around. And then sometimes what I do is I, I draw a line with the roller. I just turn it on in and I run it across. And here I'm doing, using the, that line to line up the W and the E. So this is what I have so far, the layout. And uh, it... Uh, it's going quickly. I think I'm only in about 90 minutes right here. And then here I am doing a second coat of white. Okay, in this next section I'm going to I'm going to cut out here for a second and just play this next section in real time and I'm going to leave the sound on too. And I'm going to show you how I line up the letters. Okay, I'm back here and I'm going to show you the whole thing again. I got all the layout done now with the 2015 clearance lettering. So now I'm going to go in. This is my uh, poolside color. And the whole theme is going to have kind of a color theme of this teal color, poolside, and blue, and then a darker version of this, more of like a turquoise. So I'm making his hat, his shirt, and his pants. It's actually like he has kind of like overalls on, or coveralls, or whatever you call it. Sort of a, he's kind of like a janitor character. And uh, he's coming out pretty good. Here I am just putting in the uh, face color. Now I'm going in with a darker version of the teal and doing the shadow. And it gets darker too once it dries. It gets like about 20% darker. I'm doing some highlights. 
on the hat. Same thing, I just add white to it, make a little highlight. Then the first the first coat of I did on this, I did with a brush, and then the second I did with a roller. Here's a little view from the from the inside. Okay, now I'm going in with the shadow thing. And all those of you that have seen my videos, this is so routine probably to you now. You see how I do it step by step. Now I'm going in with the highlight. The shoes are just black, and then I come back later and I do a. a yeah, I kind of I kind of messed up here because I didn't let the black dry, so it kind of kind of trying to blend it together, but it came out okay. But usually it's better to let the black dry than come back with a blue or something and just do a couple swishes. So here I am starting to outline it. I went ahead and outlined the musical notes of him whistling. I decided to leave them in white and then I just trap it in black. And uh, as I've said before, I love, I love doing the black. It's, it's fun, it's relaxing, and I really like doing it. All the little thick and thin lines, it brings life to the character. So I'm almost done. I just gotta fill out all these colors here with the black, outline them with the black. And here's the finished product. I got all the money painted in. I didn't really show how I did the broom, but the broom came out pretty good. I did like a wet on wet kind of blend on the broom. And then I did the center lettering in, in blue and white to give it some contrast. And then I used the dark kind of teal color there again, the bluish green. It looks almost green here, but it's actually kind of a blue-green. Anyway, thanks for watching. I appreciate it. <laughs>